so what we do now is um how do we show the attachments in a local action that is what we need to see now so you can see these are the three attachments which were there for our uh, our case and the requirement has come in such a way that we need to show these attachments in the local action not over here or maybe this particular section is not available for that particular case so you want to show it as a local action then how are you going to do it so i have already done you can just see here you can see this is my local action view case attachments if i click on this you can see that there is yeah there is like um, three uh, attachments which were there in the case were shown over here okay so submit so if i submit over here and also see i am into the next uh, stage i am into the next stage and we can see still here view case attachment and in this view case attachment still it will have the these things okay but the requirement is also saying that you need to delete one of them for example if i delete over here so i am getting an error because this delete is also uh, asking me to open another dialog box where the dialog box is already there so another dialog box will not be supported in pega then what we have to do and what are the what are the um options or what are the coding we have done for this particular uh, requirement to commit in the local action what we did let's see that basically whenever you are doing this um whenever we are doing this we need to make sure whether this uh criteria is for only for one case or for the entire cases of that particular application if it is one case then do all the changes for that one case itself that means whatever the changes you are doing you can just create them into only the into that particular class okay so now what exactly we have to do we have already pega is already given some otb section for us to show all the uh, attachments okay so that is what if you go to the live ui and you can see this is our section where it was showing all the case attachments you can see over here py case related content okay that's the uh, section which is given by pega okay so this is a section which pega has given now that is there in which rule set this is there in themes cosmos uh, rule set and this is in the class work dash if i do the if i do any changes to this particular um section this will be applicable for all the case types all the case types uh, of that particular application okay so it's how uh, it's your requirement what it is saying now in my requirement i am thinking that this is applicable for all the cases then what i am doing and i don't want to do the uh, i don't want to even copy the same thing uh, in same thing or save as this into my my uh, rule set instead i want to change this why do i want to change okay so why do i want to change is if i don't change these things on my case okay on my case whatever i see these options like setting icon okay and uh, the number also it will show the count also those all things would be coming on to my screen if you look over here this is totally different to this okay i want to do some modifications to this section so to do that what i do it what i did is i am saving this as the case related content section you can see this is case related section you can see that i have removed uh, this document file count this is not there and this is a stacked one and this is an inline one so that it will be showing in a smaller i mean into the in in the in center itself okay like this it would be showing in this way if not this line would be coming till here and certain things would be happen okay so first thing what i did i have made it ready with for uh, what uh, i have made my uh, section ready then when i am saying it as a local action then this section should be available in one of the uh, one of the what one of the flow action so i have called this in one of the flow action so if i see view reference then there is a flow action you can see um work dash attachments yeah you can see that there is a word dash uh, word uh, work dash attachments case related content okay so this is my um, attachments uh, flow action 
now i want to make this as a local action so make this as local action you can go to the action and you can change this directly to the local action itself so that it can be only used in local actions okay so this can be uh, this you can see do that okay so now this is the local action now so how do you call this local action so to call the local action uh, we can go to the py default of this particular class okay uh, icici so what is that uh, process um, case type py default and we can use that uh, attachments over here okay okay you can add over here so that this will be available for the entire uh, uh, entire case it will be available uh, all over the case okay if i run, now run this case icici you can see that there is something called as attachments over here you can see that okay but this uh, attachment this local action when i am doing it it is not overlaying it i mean it is not um, um, it is not showing me as a model dialog okay instead of that it was showing me it is uh, coming to the uh, existing screen or it is overriding the existing screen and showing me all the attachments okay so that's a bit uh, uh, difficult for us or we want it as a model dialog we don't want it as a Uh, what do you say um, to uh, to override that particular screen or that section see if i do that if i submit again it will come back to this this is what a typical local action looks like okay so but i don't want to do that then how do you want to configure so instead of configuring it into the py default what we do is we would be configuring on this action button to configure on this particular action button what we do is we go to the live ui of this action button and see the settings icon of this under actions you can see the menu there is something called as py work common actions okay so this we will take py work common actions and search for that particular navigation rule so there is a na navigation rule you can see there is a py work action uh, navigation rule okay So if you open this PA or caption navigation rule, we can see that there is view history. Yeah, we can see that there is a view history, manage tags, manage notifications, and some other uh, label. We have certain things which are there in this particular action button. so now we want this action button in this action button we want that view case attachments okay so for that reason what we do is we will save as this particular py work actions into our rule set so let's save as that so once we save as that is in our bank app uh, bank app uh, rule set now we can see i have added so when i i just select this and click on add below then it added my one of the um, node over here okay so for that i have written the label as view attachment view case attachments and in the local actions that means under the actions we have written that whatever the local action we created attachments we created right one of the flow action we created that particular attachment we can add over here okay so once it is added click on okay and save then come back to your case and you can see that there is a view attachments which is showing up all the uh which is showing all the attachments so in this case we don't have any attachments so let me create add attachment add content so let me take one content submit this save this so that it will be saved into our case now you can see there is a case added to our uh, sorry there is an attachment added to the case and the same thing we can see in view case attachment yes now what we have to do there is another requirement where he the user can also is able is also able to delete that particular uh, file so let me click on this delete but the problem over here is what hap what is happening is user is not able to delete this because delete is again having another model dialog so what i have to do that so for that again i need to take the navigation of this particular delete one 
so there is a delete over here so for this I have to take the navigation so for this I'll go to the live UI and click on this button and select settings under actions we can see there is a nav uh, navigation over here so what is that again this one be very case related content options so let's select that search for it and this is our navigation one link iphone attachment and if you look over here we have open download add notation p wave management manage attachment and delete if you click on this delete on the presentation you can see another local action is there which is of model dialog okay so this is providing us an issue over here because again it is a model dialog so now what i have to do is i have to open this py delete attachment model and check what was written over here okay so this is a section where it is showing us what it is showing that do you want to delete this particular attachment or not so to avoid that what i am doing is what i am doing is i'm just checking what is there in action button okay in action we have something called as py attachment links in the post activity we have something called as py delete attachment so let's take this py delete attachment and now we'll delete this local action over here add another action which is of refresh 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 this section itself and here we'll write an activity which we have already selected pway delete and for this to skip harness and skip collated uh, audit are true so yes true okay i didn't save as this you can do the save as as per your uh, requirement i am just doing only i just did the private edit. now delete is having now okay delete is now just change it to the uh, two of them are refresh the section and refresh the section okay so now let's see our case refresh it and now i'll delete okay still it got deleted over here but this particular attachment uh, this particular uh, section is not able to delete let's see that the uh, you know change <coughs> this particular delete option which is already given uh, which is already given in pega so the previous one was what uh, if i see the siblings the previous one was uh, looking like this you can see there is a local action this local action is giving us another model dialog so i am avoiding this local action and writing in such a way that um, in such a way that it is showing me it is showing me like this so in that local action we got one activity to delete the attachment so for that there is two parameters skip harness and skip collate added so we need to make it as true and then we have to do the same thing as you can see there is a refer other section okay in this refer other section what are the uh, previous refer other section is there we can write the same thing because there it was py case related content and here we have um, py case related content right so we change that to case related content you can just write that um, i can make it as py related content okay so one is py case related content and the other one is uh, case related content okay so then let's see that now when i am doing the refresh so it's not simply clicking on save you need to also do ok so just ok it save it then go back to here and uh, refresh this we got one id so go to view case attachments and delete yes you can see there is delete option and there is a delete of uh, one attachment and as well as there is a delete of attachment over here okay so that talks about py case related content and this talks about case related content which we did okay so let me add another uh, two three um, documents or two three attachments uh oh <coughs> yeah there are two uh, things and let me go to view attachments yeah i'll delete one of them here 
delete it, it got deleted and the same thing it got reflected over here submit so this is how you can show it in a local uh, action and as well as how do we do delete in that particular local action thank you so much